Aloha guys, welcome to the channel. It is Devo time. So right now I got one bait on the line. It's nice and calm out here. Uh, so far I caught uh, two goatfish, one papillo and one akule. And then I got one opelu on the line. And so beautiful day out here. And again, with our devotionals, I am sharing some parallels between faith and fishing and so in fishing uh today our, our topic is fighting right and so in fishing there are a lot of things that that you know that you have to fight right you're not just fighting fish you you're fighting the the urge uh to to uh, make a decision should i stop now or should i keep going right uh, especially on days that you haven't caught anything, uh, you really want to wait it out and, and, and still have that hope, right? Uh, I might catch something. So, so you fight that urge. Uh, do I, do I go in or do I keep fishing? Um, there's also, uh, the weather. You fight the weather conditions on a windy and rainy day. You're going to be fighting some swells. You're going to be fighting the wind. And so, uh, again, good judgment. Uh, no fish is worth your life, right? And no weather is worth your life. If the weather is um, is uh, bad, time to go in, right? If it picks up a hint and you and you can already see that it's gonna get worse, go in, right? And then you come to fish. You fight fish as well when you're when you're fishing. There's a lot of different fish that that you fight and. There, there are situations where you don't want to fight every fish, right? Take, for example, um, there, there's a fight you don't want to get into, and that is a, a fight with a shark. If you hook a shark, uh, you know, you want to play it safe. You don't want to bring the shark close to the kayak to where you're putting yourself in danger. So there's a fight that is not worth it. So what I do when I hook a shark, cut the line. All right, I try to get as much line close to me. The moment I see color, I cut the line. I don't even try and get it get it all the way close to the hook. It's too risky, not worth it. So that's a fight you don't wanna you won't, don't wanna get into, right? And then uh, uh, maybe you're fighting a nice tuna and, and it's a strong fish and at the same time you're fighting bad weather. That's a judgment call right there. So you have to be wise in that fight wisdom comes in in that fight is this fish really worth it uh if the weather's getting worse cut the line go in live to fish another day right so wisdom is is used there and then there's fish that you that you like to fight that you know that you enjoy fighting that you know that you're able to to catch that you're able to win those fights and, and so your judgment call is used uh, one of the fish i'd love to fight and um and I use light tackle is uh, the oil, right? The bonefish, bonefish, man, they can run. And I love to use light tackle to, to fight them. And, and so that's a fight that's worth my time in fishing, right? And so obviously we see that in fishing, there's a lot of fighting. Well, the same thing, same thing with, our, um, with our spiritual life. There's a lot of fighting in our spiritual walk, right? We have an enemy that we're fighting, right? The devil. Ephesians 6 verse uh, 10 and onward tells us that we are to put on the whole armor of God so that we may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil, right? To to stand against our enemy. And then, then you sometimes fight with people or even fight with, you know, your brother and sisters in Christ. And so uh, Timothy was commanded by Paul to fight the good fight of faith. And obviously, also in 1 Timothy, we see that Paul said to Timothy that he should not engage in uh, vain talk or in discussions about genealogy or basically babble or useless or vain struggle with people. He said, don't, don't enter into that. And so that's where our, our spiritual lesson really comes in. Uh, we are told to fight the good fight of faith, but we have to use wisdom to pick our fight. 
You don't have to fight every single fight that comes your way as a Christian. There are just some fights that are not worth it. They're not worth your, your peace of mind. They're not worth your stress. And so, you know, as especially uh, um, dealing with criticism. As, as a preacher, I deal with a lot of criticism. And so some some criticisms, uh, some critics, uh, they get to me. Some, you know, um, it's like water in the back of the duck. They just roll right off my back. And so in times like that, you understand this as, as a child of God. When, when people are critical of you, you know, you just got to understand there are some fights. I just saw a shark or a, a, a fish jump out over there. There are just some fights that are not worth it. That you, you have to pick your fight. You have to be wise, right? And so while we fight the good fight of faith, that doesn't mean that you uh, uh, stop and throw a stone at every dog that bark, that bark at you on your road to glory, right? There's some dogs who just go, eh, you know, <laughs> and keep on moving on. And so be wise, fight the good fight of faith, Pick your battles, right? Pick your battles. And remember that the battle belongs to who? The battle belongs to the Lord. The fight that we're fighting is, is a spiritual fight. It's not an earthly fight. We don't fight with these, right? Sometimes our our carnal mind, our flesh, will, will make us throw these up, throw these bad boys up. But um, that's not how we fight the Christian fight. We fight with love. We fight with righteousness, we fight with faith, we fight with mercy, we fight with righteous judgment, we fight with grace, we fight with the spiritual blessings that God has blessed us with. Paul the Apostle said, for the weapons of our warfare are not carnal, right? So if you're fighting the good fight with your fist, let me tell you, you're not fighting the good fight, right? And so it's a spiritual matter. And so that's one of the uh, wonderful parallels that we see um, in faith and fishing. Now, there's fighting involved. In fishing, you still have to use proper judgment. There's still wisdom to be had. Not every fight is worth it. The same thing is true in our spiritual walk. Not every fight is your fight. Some things you just got to give it to the Lord and move on. Easier said than done. I, I need to practice that more myself right and so fight the good fight of faith practice wisdom pick your fights pick your battles some some battles just not worth our time all right so god bless you please like and subscribe to the channel uh stay tuned for more content via fishing action uh or or devotional but I appreciate your support. Like and subscribe and follow the channel. It really helps me uh, as I want to share all these encouraging content with, with all of us. God bless you. Aloha and goodbye.